नेक्स्ट क्वेश्चन दिस इंस्ट्रूमेंट इज यूज इन सो ऑलवेज रिमेंबर वॉट इज दिस दिस इज एक्चुअली दी सिटेलीज दिस इज द सिटेलीज बोन पंच This is the Sitelli's bone punch, and this Sitelli's bone punch is used in cases of DCR. This is used in DCR. What is DCR? Basically, this is very very important, and many times we are asking you questions related to DCR as well as the treatment of congenital decryosystitis. This is actually the decryo cysto rhinostomy. Decryo cysto rhinostomy and tomy means the opening. So basically, we are giving the opening between decryo cysto. That means this is the lacrimal sac, and rhino means between the uh, middle meatus. Now this is also important that normally it opens in the inferior meatus. But when we are doing the decryo cysto rhinostomy, we are creating the opening between the lacrimal sac and the middle meatus for the bone cutting. What we are using is this Sitelli's bone punch. Okay. Then they have given you the other instruments, probing and irrigation. So probing ke liye basically we use the Bowman's. We are using the Bowman's lacrimal probe. The name of that instrument is the Bowman's lacrimal probe. Now, what are the instruments used for evisceration and enucleation? Look at this. They may must be looking very very similar to you, but always remember that uh, there is actually a slight difference between them. You can see the ends. Now, one important thing is whenever you have to differentiate in the instruments, always look. at their tip you don't have to see the handles okay don't look at the handles so this is actually the scoop or it's a curette okay it's a scoop or it's a curette while if you look here this is a spoon this is a spoon so the scoop or the curette is actually used for the evisceration this is used for the evisceration evisceration means you are scooping out the contents from the eyeball leaving the sclera behind but in cases of the enucleation in cases of the enucleation where we have to take out whole of the eyeball along with the part of the optic nerve so this is called as the optic nerve guide this is called as the optic nerve guide this is for removing the eyeball along with the hooking so this area is used for hooking of the optic nerve so basic difference between evisceration and enucleation in evisceration we are uh, sparing the sclera sparing the sclera and we are just removing the contents from inside the eyeball in cases of enucleation we are removing whole of the eyeball along with the part of optic nerve for that we require the optic nerve guide so i hope you have understood the difference between evisceration enucleation and their instruments also